The workflow with traditional manufacturing on inventory control is basically you get your tools made and then you do a, a big run of parts. So you have to invest money in, in the tooling and then also carrying that inventory. What we're trying to work with a lot of companies on is taking a per certain percentage of their inventory needs and try to digitize that part request and then more of an on-demand situation where as they need those parts, they can order them and have them delivered in a timely manner. With this process, you can skip the warehousing component of it, which costs for some companies it's millions and tens of millions of dollars. We're kind of at a, a, an inflection point where we can start looking at production volumes. Because we can turn around in, in days, time, with a couple thousand parts, we now cut out and eliminate the need for stocking inventory. Well, it's pretty exciting. We don't have to set up builds and then uh, you know, carry inventory on the shelf. It's an on-demand process. People let us know what they need, and within you know, two, three, four days, we can have their parts in hand. A typical process for production run starts all the way in the, the front office where we start looking at the files. Uh, it's, it's very important that we analyze and make sure that the, the file is ready to go, all the way from the actual resolution of the STL file, all the way to does it have a good geometry that's actually going to, to work for the manufacturing process. We can help go from one piece prototypes to full production runs. In an on-demand inventory scenario, we would already have digital files of the parts that they would require, and then as soon as those parts are needed, they submit the order, we can get those parts out within a matter of days.